if we look at this integral, we've got an expression that's variable squared plus a constant. Even though this expression isn't under a square root, we can still use a trig substitution. So we've got this form here, variable squared plus constant. So we want to say that the variable is equal to the square root of the constant tangent theta. The constant is 1, so we want to say that x is equal to tangent theta. Therefore, dx is equal to secant squared theta d theta. Making the substitution into x squared plus 1 squared, we've got tangent squared theta plus 1 squared, tangent squared theta plus 1 is secant squared theta, so this is secant theta to the fourth. When x is equal to 0, arctangent of 0 is 0, so theta is 0. When x is equal to 1, arctangent of 1 is pi over 4, so theta is pi over 4. x squared plus 1 squared is secant to the fourth of theta. dx is secant squared theta d theta. 1 over secant squared theta is cosine squared theta. So with the trig substitution, we've transformed the original definite integral into this definite integral.